My thoughts are all over the place again today. But I suppose it makes sense. There's lots to do. I'm quite exhausted. And after that, I just can't ever seem to uh, get my brain to stop. You know what I mean? I'm like, oh yeah, okay. I can finally relax. I don't I don't have to really worry about shit right now. But then my brain just decides, you know what? You get to think about everything now. About where I'm at in life and what I want to do with that and what I need to be happy and how well I'm doing with whatever. Like, am I meeting my expectations? Am I meeting other people's expectations? All that stupid shit, right? But just now I was thinking, man, I want to have a garden. <laughs> Is that a very unreachable dream? Like, am I being unreasonable? Is what I'm asking myself. Because, you know, I'm just thinking, man... After a long day, and also like, you know, whenever I have a day off, I want to just be able to relax. I want to enjoy some, some greenery around me, some nature. I feel like that would really make me feel at peace. You know what I mean? Do you ever get that? Well, at least, you know, it's it's always reassuring to know that you're not the only one, like, thinking a thing. Oh man, you know what we should do? One of these days, we should move together. We'll be the best fucking roommates ever. And we'll have a little garden. And we can just chill. I'll, I'll try and take care of all the plants, you know, make sure that they don't die. No promises, though. Might have to ask you for help. And if not that, then, uh... Well, then we just need to make enough money to afford a gardener, I guess. I don't fucking know. But anyway, I will, in theory, take care of the plants. And I hope you don't mind me, uh, occasionally sunbathing. I'm absolutely in love with sunbathing. Just put down a towel on a warm day, lay down, and let the sun melt me away. Cancer, here I come. <laughs> sorry, sorry, was that too dark? Man, I'm always thinking about that. I should wear sunscreen more often. I I will admit I don't I don't really do that often. Not nearly as often as I should. And that's not really good. Cause even though in the moment melting because of the sun feels quite nice. My skin's probably screaming. Just so high-pitched that I can't hear it. I'm just torturing myself at that point, right? Burn, little cells. Burn. Though, I mean, I guess that's not really what they do. I mean, that is... Yeah, no, that's not really what they do. They kind of, like, mutate, right? Is that what happens? Like, the cells get broken down and then... Oh my god, I should have paid more attention in science class. Or was it biology? It's probably biology, right? No. Yes? Oh my god, I don't even know that. At some point it's getting embarrassing. Okay, ignore I said anything at all uh, for the past, like, minute or so. Let's go back to just having a garden and relaxing and having a good time there. So, uh, how do, how do you like my plan? 
Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so chaotic, I swear. Hey, so we got a deal? You want to do it? I mean, honestly, who needs a partner if you can just have a best friend to have fun with on a daily basis? You just live together, you have a happy, peaceful little life. What's more to love? What, what more do we need? I mean, I guess some people need sex. But hey, you can also fuck your friends, right? <laughs> so, some people might disagree with that. And I mean, at that point, at that point, is there even really a big difference between that kind of situation and being in a relationship? You live together. You, you like, you, you plan your life together, you know, you, you, you pay attention to each other, make sure that the other has everything they need, and that you compromise to, you know, have both people be as happy as possible, and you have sex. Yeah, that's just a relationship at that point, right? Technically, you know, you can stay in that situation without labeling it as that until one of the people in the situation finds themselves a romantic interest in someone else. And that's when the mess really starts. And then you're like, oh my god, I should have just gotten into a relationship. To be fair, even in that, sometimes your partner, uh, well, it doesn't stay as just your partner. I mean, some people have it uncomplicated and just have an open relationship, but I don't feel like anyone can just do that. Or rather, everyone. Like, you know, some people absolutely fuck with that. They go, they go super well. It's really chill. They love that situation the way it is. But others who try to, like, force themselves to be okay with it... But aren't actually, it, it, like, it eats them alive, you know, right? And that's just, that's just not a fun situation to be in. Man, this whole shit is complicated, isn't it? Also, I have, again, already forgotten what I was talking about before. Oh my god. Um, well... Anyway, <laughs> right, yeah, uh, living together and having a garden. So, uh, you still up for that? <laughs> oh my god, we're so silly. Right, I'm getting kind of hungry. You want to order some food? Yay! Take out and delivery for the win. Alright, now the only question is, what are we in the mood for? Now we're getting back to that topic about compromises and shit. But I think you and I will manage. <laughs>